I want to show you something that I'm working on right now. It's called Universal Pixel Editor. I started creating it for my light controller, but I decided to make it um, universal so anybody can use it for their, uh, I don't know, their TLC projects or, or even Christmas lights, you know, use it with Renard controllers. Um, so basically this is a simple editor that has um, LEDs, uh, and frames or channels, uh, there are going to be a couple options that you'll be able to, um, you know, do number of LEDs and frames, so you'll be able to create animations. Uh, but this is the pretty uh, early version, so right now I have, have had it set it to um, LEDs and then frames. So basically what you do, is um, you can select the range of um, pixels and you have four colors available right now uh, of course you can change them they're not uh, fixed you can change the color to uh, anything you want but those are four colors that will be used by the different effects um, so for example uh, here I have a solid color which will fill selected square selected pixels with the color um, then what I can do is I can select more pixels and I can do a gradient between color 1 and 2 then I can swap colors because most of the tools use color 1 so um, that's why I'm gonna be doing a lot of swapping of 1 and 2 but here I can fill with a solid color then I can um, do for example gradient between color 1 and 2 and then I can fade out color 1 um, to 0 uh, so this is transition then you can of course do uh, fade ins um, you know fade outs um, you can do random colors you can do just few selected random colors. Um, you can also do black um, as a background. So you can do something like this. Um, you can use more than one color. Of course, I'm going to add, as I in improve this tool, I'm going to add more features. Um, then you can do um, you can change directions of of the way of gradient uh, so you know you you not you don't have to do it horizont horizontally um, you can do basically vertically and and um, you know you can clear areas of pixels and then also I'm working on a um, on a tool that will let you paint freehand and right now um, there's no saving functionality but um, that's coming soon but what you can do right now you can if you have let's say five LEDs and you wanna save export let's say you know 30 frames you can select those frames click uh, copy to clipboard and then basically what you have it's you have a whole bunch of RGB values for each LED and each line is a um, frame or what you can do is for the C guys if you have your project in C you can add brackets and you can export that and then you will have brackets that will let you create arrays very easily so this is this is it for now and more is coming very soon